Hello and welcome to the Shastra. Uh, let's begin with this problem. Uh, we have a problem here on number systems, number theory. Uh, and uh, the problem asks us, uh, there is this number 10 raised to 100. Uh, how many factors for this number will terminate with exactly 10 zeros? Well, to begin with, uh, we do need to know a little bit background here, you know, about the formula for the number of factors because the number is not actually, you know, such a small number that you can just, you know, fact, prime factorize it. Uh, well, you, you can very much prime factorize a number easily, but uh, we do have a formula whereby, uh, you know, we do know that if the number n, any number n is prime factorized as p1 per 100 times p2, uh, sorry, p1 per a times p2 bar b, etc where P1, P2, P3, etc. are primes and ABC are their respective powers, then the formula for the number of factors is A plus 1, B plus 1, C plus 1. Now, uh, what we do need to understand here is that when I need 10 zeros, essentially I need to keep those 10 zeros separately included for sure in the, num in the number. You know, what I'm trying to say over here is that this number 10 raised to 100 uh, first of all, this is a you know, very special number, uh, just for your knowledge. Uh, this number is called as Google. Just, you know, search for this. Uh, it's a very famous number. Anyways, so for this number, I do need to figure out that I need, uh, you know, exactly 10 zeros. Uh, we do have a concept whereby, you know, if I factor out 10 raised to 10 from this number, for example. So uh, if I reinterpret this number as, okay, 10 raised to 10, times 10 raised to 90. So essentially this is nothing but the 10 zeros that I need for myself. And this is another, you know, number in the multiplication, which let's say is N1. So for this number N1, as many factors I can figure out, you know, those many factors of the number Google will end with, be careful, 10 zeros, not exactly 10 zeros, right? There's a very big distinction here to understand. Uh, however, if I just complete this thought, then I can say that for, uh, you know, this number, the number of factors that end with 10 zeros is, uh, you know, uh, well, first of all, prime factorize 10 raised to 90, that will be 2 raised to 90 times 5 raised to 90. Well, so number of factors here are 91 into 91, directly writing 91 square. So these many factors are there which end with, well, you know, the number of factors are, let's say Z are the number of zeros, that is greater or equal to 10. That is what I have obtained. But the question is actually asking me, find the number of factors for which the number of zeros is exactly 10. So at this point of time, a little bit of a, you know, uh, critical thinking kicks in, whereby you need to figure out that what I need for myself is Z equal to 10, which can be reinterpreted as, z greater equal to 10 minus z greater equal to 11 because you know this will include 10 11 12 13 all the way up to 100 and this will include 11 12 13 14 all the way up to 100 zeros subtracting this from this gives me the required exactly 10 zeros so well that was the critical step and then you know if this is understood then uh, the working is now fairly simple just reinterpret this number again as well n as 10 raised to 11 because well i need to figure out z greater or equal to 11 and times 10 power 89 so again concept being this is my 11 zeros this is my uh, let's say n2 for which the prime factorization becomes 2 power 89 times 5 power 89 so then for this number n2 the number of factors becomes well 89 plus 190, so 90 times 90, 90 square. So therefore my value, required value, uh, let's say x uh, is equal to, you know, uh, n uh, for z greater or equal to 10, which I have obtained here as 91 square minus 90 square. If you quickly do the logic of a plus b, a minus b, so you will get the value, well, 181. So yes, uh, I hope you got the point here that you know sometimes you do need to think a little bit beyond the obvious formula and this was one such problem. Thanks for watching and do subscribe to our channel.